welcome back to the channel guys yes so guys today the video that i've uploaded guys i'm gonna be doing some dreadlocks yeah the african way of making dreadlocks yeah so we are going to be making dreadlocks so but as we are going to be making these dreadlocks we are going to do them in the okay we are going to do them locally like the way we do them in our village yeah we're not going to use the modern method yeah we're going to use the local way of making the dreadlocks yeah so as you can see this is our gentleman seated at the stool as he is yes so before making the dreadlocks guys we are gonna wash the head first because it's a little bit dirty yeah so we are going to first wash it and then yeah and then we start the process guys so yeah guys as you can see here is my benzene here is my jerry can and my water yes so we are going to first wash the head yeah guys they normally use shampoo but then as for our case the local way we don't use shampoo so we are going to use soap yeah so this is soap so we're going to be using white star white star soap yes, it's one that we are going to be using so the water is a little bit warm yeah the bottom the water must be warm yes sir So I have to scratch the head that I can remove the dirt on the skin. And maybe if the head has some dandruff, I have to make sure I scratch. But not that to 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 scratching the head. It has to be a little bit gentle. <laughs> so I have to do it gently as I'm scrubbing because you never know. Someone may have a wound in the head. So you have to do gently, as you can see. I think I can get my towel or something like right. cover. Where are you now? Where are you now? Where are you now? Where are you now? Yeah, guys, we are now drying the head, as you can see. Yeah. So guys, we've got our two eggs here, as you can see. Send it up. Yeah, as you can see, we've got our two eggs. Yeah, these are the two eggs that we've got. Yeah, so we are going to be using these two eggs, and this is the cup, and this is our knife so that we are going to use to crack the egg. Yeah, so that. Yes, yeah, so guys, as we are doing the dreadlocks here, we're not going to be using the the whole egg including the egg yolk yes yeah, so the egg yolk is excluded in the process so as i'm going to crush the egg i have to make you have to make sure the egg yolk is not out i have to make sure the egg yolk doesn't go into the other part of the egg 
Ndinye nyati. Goja ngoji kwa ati. Ogamba ndinye nyange. Nge gulonjo da shiku gampo vinye. So guys, I have to use only the water without the egg yolk. That's why the hole is a little bit small. Actually, I think I can crack the whole egg and then I remove the egg yolk. Guys, these are local eggs from the local chicken. Yes, so I think you can see the egg yolk as well. It is very, very, very yellow. Yes, so it is not supposed to be used. So the water, this water, is then that I'm going to be using this water. Yes, so I get the water, I pour it on my hands. And then I smear in the head. Did again the Eric went to the middle and I made a church and wait and church and a general. We don't get it. I have to make sure I smear. Yeah, so guys, this is the sponge. Yes, I'm going to be using a sponge. As you can see, it's a bathing sponge. But then, we're going to be using it to make the dreadlock. So I think we shall no longer be using it for showering, for bathing. Yes, since it is already going to be an egg, so this is the sponge. So I have to make sure I do this. <coughs> yeah, so guys, some people do use Omo. If at all they have not used the eggs, yeah, so they use Omo to make these dreadlocks. Yeah, so guys, I think you can see the hair, the added looks are now the starting to come out as you can see. Yeah, just because they're a little bit soft, but then I have to make sure they become a little bit hard. Yeah, as you can see, our dreadlocks are almost coming, guys. So I think I can add some more. Yes, so guys, I think you can see our dead looks just because 
the hair was a little bit short. Yeah, it was a little bit short. Yeah, but I think the thing has come out. Look, it has come out very well. Yeah. The thing has come out very well, as you can see, compared to the way the hair was. Yeah, guys, the hair is, the dread looks. So he <coughs> is the gentleman, smart as he is. Yeah, looking so good. Yes, yeah, so I think it's a little bit hard. The hair is a little bit hard now. It's not that soft. Yeah, but yeah, our dreadlocks. Those are our dreadlocks, guys. Yes, yeah, so the hair was a little bit short. So this is another method of also making dreadlocks here in Uganda in my home village. Yeah, so we've only used, guys, we've only used a sponge, a mere sponge, and then maybe two eggs. Yeah, we only used two eggs, but here we used the local eggs from the local chicken. Yes, and the eggs that we used, we only used two eggs and a spoon. And here he is, smart as he is, ready as he is. Yeah, so it doesn't, the eggs don't even smell, guys. They don't even smell. So because the thing has dried, so the hair is so clean because we first washed the hair, the head. Yes, yeah, so thank you for subscribing my returning subscribers yeah and if at all you've not subscribed yet please endeavor to subscribe endeavor to like endeavor to share guys yes yeah, so thank you so much see you in our next video that i'll be uploading keep on the watch guys thank you so much let's have that